General exposition factor is very high. This affects the number of police patrols and may lure DEA attention. Try to be more stealthy. My goodness, dude, the block is hotter than ever before. You guys have seen these messages in the past couple of episodes. General risk factor is high. This may endanger your business and cause a raid. Try to be more cautious. We've been getting after it. There's no question about that. We've been running around like we're, we're the king of the world. You know what I mean? Like not really worried about anything. We haven't been caught in a long time, which is, is good. But at the same time, they're still taking notice. I'm pretty sure every single time you do a, a sale in the daytime, they still kind of take note of that. You know, they, they might not catch you in the act, but they see you running around. They see you crossing the border. They see you in all these sketchy parts of town and the cops aren't dumb. Even if they don't catch anything on you, every time they search you, they're gonna remember that face because you're a sketch ball, I guess. I, I don't know, we'll see what happens. But you guys can see here, there's actually a graph that shows you how bad you're doing in terms of, of attention. And uh, I, I would say it doesn't get much worse than that for a, a risk factor. I, I think we kinda need to work on that. Our exposition factor is drug lord, which I'm kind of proud of. I think Pablo would be proud of us as well. But uh, yeah, man, we we definitely have to cool it off a little bit. You know what I mean? Like we, we've just got to kind of chill out and, and, and take some time away from the chaos. Now, obviously the best thing we could do is to just kind of chill out here in the apartment. We don't have a TV or anything, but we could sleep a lot. We could play some guitar, you know, drink, drink a little beer, just kind of social distance ourselves. That's what a responsible adult would do in this time period but we're not very responsible. So we are still gonna be going out, but I think I wanna do a couple of things in this episode. I wanna first of all, really limit our daytime runs. I don't really wanna be out in the daytime. We're gonna go out at night where they're not gonna see us as well and we're gonna try to, you know, kinda stay off the radar a little bit. Hopefully we don't get caught. I mean, that would be the worst thing possible, but obviously high risk, high reward there. I also really kinda just wanna focus on working with our dealers. Obviously, when you do it in bulk, we give it to them, they disperse it to all the people and then come back and give us the money. That's one transaction. That's not running around, crossing the border a bunch, doing a bunch of crazy stuff where you can potentially end up getting caught. So that's kind of my idea here. We'll see what happens. We're gonna focus on the dealers and focus on working at night. And again, take a look at this. Let's see if we can get this, get this down by the end of this episode. So we do have some points to spend. I'm gonna say, let's get an extra pocket. I'm gonna work on our stamina. And then I say maybe health. All right, that looks pretty good to me. Now I did say, I don't really wanna go outside right now. But there is one thing that I want to do. Grab this cash here. What do we have? We've got $635. I'm going to go ahead and throw this in our pockets. I'm going to drop off our backpack. I feel like carrying a big backpack like that around. Again, even if the cops don't stop us, it looks pretty sketchy. So we're, we're going to chill out on that. Let me see what we have in, uh, in our bank account. Hopefully we have enough. $343. Not really that much. All right. We're, we're going to have to, we're going to have to work with this. We're, we're going to make it work. And uh, basically we are gonna go to the furniture store and we are gonna buy some secret, um, some secret like compartments to be able to put in our house just in case we do get raided. Obviously being labeled a T word is a pretty big accusation. I don't even think I could say that word if I wanna monetize this video. But uh, yeah, that's, that's not a good thing. And I, I am worried that even if we keep a low profile, we might end up getting raided anyway. So we're, we're just gonna see, we're gonna see how this works. So I'm gonna say, let's, let's, put, uh, let's put 250 in. That's a pretty safe deposit. We haven't deposited in a while. I'm really hoping that's not gonna make things even worse for us. That could get their attention even more. But uh, we're gonna go in here. We're gonna talk to good old Donald. Big man D, and we're gonna get uh, we're gonna get three of these secret containers, 190 each, 570 total. We've got 593 in the bank account. Order and pay. Swipe that plastic, baby. That's what I'm talking about. That legal moolah. And uh, we are gonna send this to our uh, where's where's our main one? This this is odd. I didn't know that you you could you couldn't put it in your main apartment. We can't put it in our main apartment. We're gonna have to to put it in one of these. Shoot, I kind of wish we wouldn't have bought all three then because we, we could have kind of split them up a little bit i guess I, I mean i guess we're just gonna put it in our our small warehouse oh look at that we just got dimitri addicted to uh to the big old h that's good stuff there man i'm, I'm kind of sad that kind of foiled my plan a little bit i was hoping to be able to to kind of hide this stuff in our main apartment they've got dogs now excuse me they've got They've got drug sniffing dogs now. 
Bro, whoa, <laughs> what? That is terrifying. All right, so we're, we're going to go over to our, uh, our apartment over there. You can use the sewage tunnels to be able to get across. You guys can see we went from the kennel over here to downtown, which is pretty convenient. So we're going to head on over to our, uh, to our house. I'm a little bit turned around here. We want to go left, I think, yeah. Um, just want to kind of try to start using that so that we don't have to get searched every time we cross the border. Oh my goodness, dude. There's so many guys out here. Please don't get searched. Trev, just don't get searched. Don't get searched. It's not good for you. Just, just look like a, a nice, solid, productive, helpful member of society. You know, we might need to shave up a little bit, put a little suit on or something, maybe buy some furniture so our, for our house so it doesn't look like a cracked in. All right, here we go. So how do we, uh, we want to go into furniture mode. And these are the containers that we can place. So I'm thinking, hold on, let's open this up. I'm thinking we definitely put one in the bathroom, right? I'm gonna put one like down here in the corner. Yeah, that's that's a pretty good spot. And then can we put furniture in front of it? I'm gonna put another one here. And then I guess we'll put another one over here. We're gonna have to get some furniture to put up in front of it. But you guys can see it's it's got a, a 20 size and a 30 weight. So like how much is that gonna hold? We've got two tins. Are you gonna be able to put the two the two tins in there? That's gonna get us to five weight and 10 out of 20 size. So you can hold about 40 grams in there. That's not bad. I mean, we, we could we could work with that. I really wish we could put this in our main main apartment. But once we start getting our Vallejo over on this side and we start setting up this house as an actual workshop where we have a mixer and everything, that's obviously gonna be pretty useful. This, this may even end up becoming our main apartment. I guess we should go collect some money from one of our dealers over on the other side of town. So we're gonna go back to our sewer uh, great manhole cover thing and we're gonna travel back and then uh, we're gonna go back to the computer. Looks like we did have an order from the uh, from the Asians that we're gonna have to get a bunch of crystal for. And uh, I, I guess other than that, we're just gonna focus on the dealers and try to keep a low profile. So let's go grab this money quickly before the sun goes down and we're, we're gonna kinda get some deals rolling at night. How you doing, Chloe? What you up to? What you got? 1100? Oh shoot. That wasn't nearly as big of a, uh, as big of a drop as I was expecting. A lot of our dealers have been ordering a ton. I guess she's kind of kind of new, but a lot of them, I mean, we're getting, you know, two, three, four grand per pop, which is pretty nice. And that's kind of, you know, like I said, what we're going to focus on this episode, we're going to lose some respect, unfortunately. We may eventually end up having to go out and, and do some more tagging and spray painting and stuff like that to earn that respect back. But I, I think, you know, even though that'd be a pain in the butt, it's definitely going to be a lot better than ending up getting raided and, and losing everything. I honestly don't even know what happens. How crazy would that be if it just, like, ended your game? Like, you're going to jail for 30 years. Goodbye, you, you piece of human trash or something like that. I hope not. All right, so we, we've got some money now. Let me go ahead and throw all the money in the backpack. Throw all this in here, beautiful work. Then we're gonna be able to drop this cash on the counter, keep it right there. Let's take a look at our laptop and see what we've got going on. So these guys need 340 sorted into 2017. Oh, 1720 grand packs, sorry, I was gonna say it the opposite way. That is so much. That's two runs, dude. Like, I, I, I don't even know how we're gonna do that. We're, we're, I, like we said, I, I don't want to cross the border, so I guess we're going to have to pay off the construction guy. Either that or, like, no, we, we, I was going to say we could put it in our pocket to make a bunch of runs, but the 20G packs won't fit in a pocket. That's too big for a pocket. That is crazy. When does he need it by? Let me see our, our tasks here. By Thursday, and it's currently Monday. All right, so we, we can wait on this. We should probably order it and get it back into the apartment get it split up, get it good to go, but we can wait on delivering it. We've got some dealers that, that need us though, so I'm gonna meet to collect some cash, meet to collect some cash, meet to collect some cash, and meet to collect some cash. Boy, that's what I'm talking about. Now, we, we've really gotta keep an eye on everything. Like, I don't know if I should wait until nighttime to go do this, but I also feel like that's way more sketchy to wait till nighttime because we do have a lot more cops out right now, so I honestly just kinda wanna stay off the streets in general. You know, if, if it's a big dealer, you know, delivery or something that we have to make happen, I'm, I'm down to, to risk it for the biscuit. But uh, little things, like even collecting money, I just, I, I don't know if it's really worth being out right now and having that risk. So I guess we'll see what happens. What's up, Kuch, Kuchpenka? Appreciate it, bro. Where's our next one? It's going to be uh, 
over to the right, and then Leon is straight ahead of us. Dude, we are we are making so much money right now. Leon, what's up, my guy? 1400 right there, and then our last one I think is gonna be over here. Oh shoot, it's telling me my exposition is very high again. Oh man. Let me let me let me hold up. Wrong button. Oh, we're up to oh, dude, our exposition went up. It, okay. We I mean, uh, if you want me to be honest, I think we I think we just have to stay off the streets. I, I I think this is to the point where like it's it's getting a little bit too hot. Look, the, those guys will probably pull us off just for walking by. You know what I mean? And we've got a backpack full of forty three hundred dollars right now. I just I I don't I, we are not meeting out in public. We are straight up quarantining. We'll we'll do maybe one thing at a time, but we we really we really need to chill out, bro. Either that, or we need to take all of our work and move it over to the warehouse and put it in the secret compartments, because this is not good. It's almost like I'm addicted to the money, though. You know what I mean? Like we're we're selling the addiction, but I'm also addicted to that. Like I I, I want to go out and get money. I'm waiting for police hours here. We just got police hours. All right. We need to go pick up the money. We got cash over here. I think that's our guy in the orange jumpsuit. Got cops over there, but we should be good. We should be able to cross the street. Working at night reduces exposition. Oh shoot, that's that's not our guy. My bad. Our guy is over here. What's up? How you doing, Charlie? Give it to me. $2,000, 2300 that's what I'm talking about. So yeah, we're working at night is gonna reduce our exposition. I don't know, what was the other one? The, the risk factor? Oh, both of them have already reduced. Shoot, there's a dog over there. Can the dog smell me? Or can he only smell drugs? I would imagine he's... He's probably got a pretty good sniffer. Alright, we're, we're just gonna be very careful. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's get back. So after doing one thing at night, one single thing, our risk factor has gone down. Or is it just down because it's nighttime and they don't expect us to be out? I'm not sure. We're, we're really going to kind of get into the nitty gritty today and we're going to see if we can, uh, see if we can, can really figure this out. So that, that was good. That was, that was a solid little run right there. Let me pick up this cash. We're going to drop it. So we got 6k and that plus the other like 4,500 stack. We've got a lot of money here. Uh, I guess let's put an order in with Eddie. Uh, so what do we need? We needed uh, from Tom 340 grams of the crystal. So let's go ahead and make a new order of that crystal 340 dude. That is Ridiculous. We'll get a little bit of each sounds good to me. It's gonna bring us up to 5100 Let's get like 60 and and 60 maybe might be looking pretty good. Try that out a little bit off. 58 and 58. Go ahead and send that order through. Look at that, dude. 340 grams of crystal. That is that is crazy. So we're probably going to have to end up waiting three hours for this. So that's going to be, yeah, two hours and 55 minutes. That's going to be another thing. I mean, do you guys think, I mean, two towers is easy. 4G four, four of coke. We, we can run that. that. That's an easy one. Eastern slums. See, that gets kind of crazy because they get all the way out in the farmland. Another two towers. H. Three of that sounds good. If there's anything in two towers, I mean, West Old Town is usually pretty easy too. Um, well, let, let's let's start with these two. Let's just keep an eye on this. We want to make sure we keep this going down. Back outside, dude. This isn't sketchy at all. The thing is, the the dogs can smell it. The dogs can smell it. You got to be so careful now. We're good. Drop this off the Corgian. What did you want? You wanted the Coke. There's that Vallejo. We're good. Go, 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 go. Go, go, go. Lindsay, here you go. There's your Harrow. Take it. Take it and go. Take it and go. Take it and go. We're good. We're good. There's some down at the end of the street, but we should be fine. Oh my goodness, dude. I feel like if we get caught out here, you know, even even with nothing on us, that's going to push it over the edge. I'm, I'm really nervous about it. All right, we're back home. We made it. Let me check how we're looking. Oh, look at that. Dude, our stuff goes down quick. I didn't I didn't realize it went down that quick. That's that's exciting. So we, I mean, I guess my plan was to stay inside. We just want to stay inside during the daytime. Working at night is actually going to help us out big time. So let's see what else we have. We've got six cheese of the the Colombian over to the kennel. See, I I really I 
she's addicted and that would be good but i just i i don't i don't think I don't think that's a good idea right now. Screw it, we're gonna do it. All right, we're going back out, man. This is making me nervous, but ultimately, if we don't get caught, this is the best thing we can do. So we've got a little little H drop off right here, and then we've got the 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 coke that you guys saw over in the kennel, which is honestly the the worst part of the map to deliver to, without a doubt. Where did those guys go? Risk it for the biscuit! Run, mother sucker! Oh my goodness, dude, I was so nervous about that. All right, where is this chick at? She's all the way back in the back by the dumpster. Shoot. The, the problem is, is we're gonna be able to drop this off, no problem. Boom, there it is. You 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 got it, girl. Enjoy that stuff. I really kind of risk my, my booty for this, but now we've gotta get back. And getting down here is the easy part, because you can kind of see the whole street, you can see the corner, you can see everything. Now we have to blindly run back and take a right-hand turn over there to be able to get back to our apartment. It is it is not good. All right. I'm risking it. I'm risking it. We're going to try a new route. We're going to go around behind these guys. Dude, it worked. We go around this way. It worked, baby. Oh my goodness, that was so clutch. Woo -hoo -hoo. That is what I'm talking about. Back home, safe and sound. Let's check on it. Better safe than sorry risk factor and the Fox of Wall Street exposition factor, dude. My goodness. If we would have kept going like we were, we would have been in big trouble. Like we, we would have been completely screwed. There is, is no doubt about that. All right, here we go. So uh, let me see what other orders we have. I mean, supermarket, downtown, dead town, dead town. All of this is gonna be on the other side of the border. We could go cross through the, um, we could go cross through the sewers, pick up our backpack over there and run some routes. I'm down for it. We're, we're gonna keep this up. I'm trying to get our exposition factor as low as possible so that uh, that in the daytime next time we can kind of get get a little ratchet. Really, we, we could have been smarter about this, dude. We could have... Uh, did not mean to hop over that. I meant to jump to look, but I guess we're good. We've got guys over there. We're good on them. Let's be smart here. We're good here. It, it, oh, shoot. They're right by the thing. But yeah, we, we could have been we could have been smarter. We could have made the last delivery and then immediately dropped down. But I guess I guess we'll still be good. Through the sewage hatch, no clue what's gonna be awaiting us on the other side. All right, now we're gonna have to get all the way back to our apartment over here, dude. This is not good. Don't really know this side of town as well. Probably not the best idea to be running down the middle of the street. If you want me to be honest, this is one of the worst ideas we've had. I'm just going to try to get to our apartment and, and, and lay low for a minute. Oh my goodness, dude. We made it. We're good to go. Ah, are we are we good? Did we, we didn't get any extra. No, nope, we're, we're still good to go there. Okay, so thanks to one of you guys in the comments. I think I know how to get our computer active. In, uh, in this this warehouse. I'm pretty much just gonna try to, to organize this a little bit better here. So we've got the, the Mary back here. We're gonna try to get everything in one single line to open up some space on the other side of the desk to be able to um, put our computer over there. So we've got that and then I think we're gonna put uh, Put X next to it is going to be our second biggest thing. Your boy is getting so organized right now. It feels so good, man. We, we really made this thing look nice. My goodness, why do we have so many three packs of this? All right, we're just going to throw all these down. I can I can hear the cops outside. That's not a good thing. Let's put some uh, put some medium jars in front of each of these, and then we can start uh, we can start dragging stuff in. So this is going to be that crystal. We're going to put all the little ones in here so we can get it nice and organized. Then here we've got our uh, our Coke. So we're just gonna keep that, that nice and white. Here we've got our X, make that pink. Drag all the little ones in so it makes it nice and organized. And then we've got our, our amp over here. I guess we can make that yellow. Sounds good to me. And we're gonna put all these little ones in here. So we've got a nice little organized workstation here. And now we're gonna be able to put our computer on the right side, I hope. I'm not sure if it's gonna if it's gonna fit, but I hope. So we're gonna go to equipment mode. Our laptop 
Beautiful, and now we can access all of our orders from this side of the border. That's what I'm talking about, baby. All right, so we've, I mean, we've got quite a few. I, I'm, I'm gonna go through, I'm gonna pick the smart ones, or we might just try to do them all. 10 deliveries, 22 Gs. We also just had our package dropped off that we're gonna have to go get to quickly, so we, we've just gotta get right into this, dude. We gotta be quick here. So four, anyone who orders four is gonna get two twos, of course. We got that. Next one's gonna be over here in between the two, uh, the two silo looking things. Can we hop this fence? I don't think we can. We're gonna have to go around the, the sweet old fashioned way. So we're gonna run back here. Very inconspicuous spot for Basilia here. She's got two twos, so we're gonna drop off that. All right, next up, I think I'm gonna go over to the cemetery. We've got two orders over there right next to each other. I do appreciate the congregation. That makes things a little bit easier for me. I think if we kind of stick to the fields and the grassy areas, there's definitely less chance of having a police officer walking around back there. It's not guaranteed, but there's there's definitely less chance. So here we go. We've got these two. Juliet, what up, girl? You're just looking for two. So we can drop that off. We've got uh, got your friend, Marie. What up, girl? You're, uh, you're looking for four, so you got that. Bad Asia's got an order back here. How you doing, James? James Yo Mama is his name. That's, that's great. All right, we're gonna drop that off. We've got two more back here, and it looks like we might actually be able to just run through backyards to be able to get to them. So you know what? I was, I was a little bit worried about this, but I feel like we're in a pretty good spot, man. I, I feel like this was probably the best thing that we could have possibly done. The one problem is is that one of the orders was on the other side of the wall plus we have to go get uh we have to go get what's it called go get that that pickup so i think we're gonna try to do that all at once we've got somebody back here this actually let us in the perfect thing so we're gonna be able to drop off the two here do we have enough money we should have more than enough we're gonna open this up 350 dollars, dude are you kidding me Oh, I hate these guys. So now we're gonna be able to go. We're oh shoot, it's kind of in a, it's kind of in a, a bad location. Um, all right. I say let's just go. Let's oh, shoot, 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 shoot. Oh, let's. It's gonna take multiple runs because there's so much stuff in this package. I think we gotta hit it once. And then we, we're gonna have to hit it again. Where is it? It's in, oh, dude, it's the one inside the freaking thing. All right, we got this. Just grab as much as you can. Just kidding, we're gonna be able to get all of it. All right, I'm, I'm gonna go back home. I'm gonna drop this off. This is, this is too much. This is too much right now. We're gonna drop this off and then we'll go run that last package. <sighs> Oh my gosh, dude. You guys think we got enough product? This 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 has reached absolutely ridiculous levels, dude. This this is so outrageous. All right, we're we're going to throw all that down. We've got our three pack left. I'm going to go ahead and save just because I can't believe we made it to this point and uh we're we're going to go back down. This this is this is crazy. I can't believe we were able to to pick up all of that stuff in the last one. All right, so we've got guys over there. Nobody over there. Let's run. Let's run. Got guys over there. <laughs> Bro, if we don't get caught here, we are the absolute goats. There's there's undeniable fact that we are the, the best the best dealer there ever was. We we just made 10 deliveries and picked up 500 grams of product all in one night. All without getting caught. What's up, Chop? Hopefully I don't I don't eat my words. Oh wait, what? What does he want? He wants two of Coke. Are you kidding me? I thought there was somebody that wanted three. Did we miss somebody? Oh, we missed a couple people. There's a two, there's oh shoot. It's gonna be fine, bro. Your boy's not gonna miss a delivery. That is a uh, that's a personal promise right now. We're we're gonna get this done. No ifs, ands, or buts. We are getting this done. Alright, we're we're back. We're gonna hit up old do back here. Don't worry, we got your we got your two. So I'm gonna go ahead and uh, and throw that in there. Beautiful. Now we've got two other deliveries. I think I just got a little bit too excited, and I thought that you know we were next to the the 
uh, underground tunnel, so we are going to be able to easily uh, get back to the other side and quickly finish things up. I think we, we forgot that we had a couple more drops, so we, we could have been smarter about that, but we're, we're going to be just fine. Now we're going to go back over. We're going to have to sneak to the kennel. Maybe quiet. He went that way. These guys are going this way. Shoot, this is not good. Oh, man. These guys are probably going to come back through here. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, okay, okay. We got to get back to the kennel, dude. Go, 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 go. I think I heard, I think I heard cops off to our right. Maybe, are we good? I definitely heard the click of a radio, but I think we might be good for now. Anybody over here? Oh my goodness, dude. Could be coming back there from behind the gas station. Whoa! Did they get us? I don't think they got us, dude. I think we're good. All right, where, where are things? There's one guy right to our right and then another one up the street on the left. Okay, we gotta be very careful. What's up, bro? Hey. I just heard cop. I just heard radios. What the f Since when? Do they cut through the middle like that? Yo! <laughs> oh my goodness, and there's one over there, so we don't want to go that way. What are these guys going to do? They, they they better go up that left street, but technically that's where our next drop is, so we don't really want to mess with that. I think we're, we're good. We can, honestly, if anything, it's kind of like keep your, your friends close and your enemies closer. Let's, let's keep an eye on them. If we know where they are, they aren't going to be able to do any damage to us. So let's see if we can, can follow up. The thing is, sometimes they stop and turn around really abruptly. So you've obviously got to be careful of that. He's going to be over. I mean, I think cutting through yards is, is always best case scenario. Is he across to the right? He's across to the right. We did it, dude. Oh, my gosh. I, I nearly had a, a heart attack about 15 times, but that's it. All, all orders taken care of. Look at that. Oh, my goodness. Now we've just got to safely get back to our... Uh, our safe house over here. I mean, there's there's closer ones, but none that have have laptops or product or anything. Oh my, dude, my my heart actually hurts. This has been the most stressful episode. Where are we at? We're we're a good boy and we're a dope ninja. Oh, it feels good, but honestly, I the stress levels that I just went through. I I don't I don't know if it's worth it. I, I think we're good, honestly. I I, I think considering. How, how much work we did on our, our risk factor and stuff. I'm curious to see if it goes back up during the daytime. It's 2.56. I'm going to go ahead and save because that was the most miraculous thing ever. We're going to go ahead and skip ahead to morning time. That way we don't really have anything to worry about. And uh, I, I want to see what happens. I want to see if our risk factor goes back up or what. I do feel a little bad here because we have had a, uh, ooh, we've got a lot of orders and honestly, I mean, our, our dealers are going ham. We got a little bit of a cash delivery here, so that's going to be good. Uh, 22 of the China White, 38 of the Coke, 13 of the China White, and 13 of the China White. Sounds good to me. So we're going to get back across the border as soon as this, uh, as soon as this time changes over, once we can start venturing out again. There it is. Police hours have been lifted. It's daytime. And let me see, it looks like our risk factor has been completely fixed. We've actually got uh, Chuck Coco, new addiction, so that's pretty exciting. But uh, it's a brand new day. There's a brand new set of, uh, of deliveries to make. And man, I, I honestly didn't expect we were going to be able to fix ourselves that quickly. But I'm glad we were able to. So I, I, we just, we kind of have, have to realize, we have to remember to keep an eye on that. If we let it get too out of out of hand, out of pocket, then uh, we're we're gonna be in, in deep doo doo. So we definitely want to uh, to kind of slow things down a little bit. So hope you guys enjoyed this episode. I'm gonna go meet up with a couple of my dealers here. We're gonna pick up some cash. We're gonna get ready to pay back Eddie. 
Uh, probably next episode, let's maybe think about trying some new mixes. I don't know if I want to try Fent yet, the Fentanyl or whatever it is. But, uh, we, I, I, I don't know. I, I guess we'll see what happens. Let me know what you guys want to see down in the comments. Hope you guys enjoyed. I'm going to see you guys in the next one. I can't even carry this money because it's so large. We're going to have to go back and get a backpack. I'll see you guys later. Peace out.